I don't know why, but I feel like the blue tubby is like the weakest of them all. Well, it depends on how you count the blue tubby. If you count them as two, or you count them as one. But they take the lap, they take the spot 19 for being the weakest. But that that doesn't mean that they're very weak because that there are at least three. Well, there's two of them. There's just two of them. Let's just say that there's two. So yeah, so the one that's coming in the 18th spot is gonna be Poe, and I gotta say Poe is pretty weak right here. Well, Poe is very weak. Let's just say that. Poe is the weakest boss. The weakest boss because, like, well, you know, she, since she plays higher than the Brutally, it doesn't mean the Brutally is better, worse than her. Because the Brutally is kind of weak, and that's why there's two. So, that, so Poe 2 really is plays 19. Well, if you compare them individually, then. Po 2 is stronger, so Po 2 takes the lead for 18, one, one ahead. 17th spot for me is going to be Lala, and, well, I don't know, Po, po and Lala seems equally matched, but I know Lala most likely will win. Look at that creepy face. So, Lala is taking 18, no, 17th spot for the, the, for the battle of who's the greatest Teletubby or Swordy Tubby. So, yeah. 16 and 15, I put Ron and Dipsy. So, uh, the only reason I'm showing Casey and both of them right now at the same time is because, you know, both of them have the same e AEs, same attack speed, and basically the same animation besides Bond, because Bond is a pet, doesn't. But either way, I think Dipsy's gonna take the lead, because, well, Dipsy's gonna go in 15 place, and Ron's gonna go into 16. It's like, I, when I put them to fight, then, you know, Dipsy must be win to me, so. Yeah, that's why Dipsy's on 15th place. Moving on to 14th place, I think, is going to be Tinky Winky. And you may think I'm only doing Tinky Winky right now because I want Poe. Well, I don't want that because I don't think Tinky Winky is that strong. Because I just put him in a battle with Tinky Tank and he pretty much lost. So coming in. 14 or 15 place is Tinky Winky. He's really not that weak though. I don't. I wouldn't say he's a weak boss because he does have that extra AE, which actually does a lot of damage. But I think Tinky Winky has to take the 14th spot of this race. Well, I guess all the original four Teletubbies just had the ranks or one of basically the four of them anyway so let's go to the team place it's gonna be yeti tubby i put him in fight with tinky tink again and he pretty much lost badly but to be honest he does have the spikes but i don't they, they are effective that i'll give you that for sure they are effective but to be honest, Yeti Tubby pretty much is like coming in for a place right now. And so that's sad. But at least, well, at least one of his, at least Tinky Tink is still not really in yet. So yeah, 13th place, Yeti Tubby. And that 12th spot is going to be Ghost Girl. And I know she does have the Shadow 80s. But she really doesn't have those spikes and has a swell melee like Poe and Guardian. And like po well, unlike Poe and Guardian or Tinky Winky, they at least have a good AUs. Well, at least Poe and Guardian has those spikes. Rocks and spikes. But 
spot. This girl has to take this fourth spot, in my opinion. Close between 11 and 10. But on uh, 11th place, it's gonna be undead poem. So, this, so actually, I'll tell you how this is close. So, you see, Poe and the Guardian are actually equally matched. Because Poe has the faster spikes, but Guardian has the slow spikes, but the stronger ones. So it's basically an equal match, but Poe came in 10th place. No, 11th, I meant. And yeah, she's, been, she's one of the 10th, no, 11th bosses. She's top, well, she's in top 15, but not top 11. I mean, top 10. She was close, though. And of course, the 10th place will be the Guardian. Because the Guardian is the only match to the Poe, like I said, in 11. But the 10th Guardian, Tubby, is, yeah, the winner. I don't know what I said. Um, yeah. So, um, Molten is the winner for um, round 10, I think. No, wait, um, no, okay, no, no, it's just, um, oh, 10th place. Okay, then in the ninth spot, it's gonna, in the imposter is gonna be on the ninth spot. So I tested him out with Poe and Big Tummy, and they, he lost both times. So then that means imposter will place ninth place. Right behind the guard, actually, maybe the imposter's time. Well, this is my opinion, so yeah! So, that's the ninth place. Placing top eight is Cave Tubby, the Disorder Tubby. It has the rocks, and it's past the melee. It's like, it's like a boss that you need in the game. Not really. It's like a boss, you know, like, it's like that. But anyways, this one to me is going to be on top eight. Which means he's going to, he's going to be right behind someone else. Now it's someone, I, I don't know who it's going to be, but I think it's probably Poe? Or, yeah, maybe one. Or like, Piranha Fish guy. Which is Dipsy. Top second place. Well, quite. What is it? Second place is the new Tinky Tank. So he was. He's kind of a strong. One of the strong tanks in this game. Tank will be on second place. I mean, he's really the weakest out top 10 now. Ooh. Well, not really. The positive. He basically is, I don't know, a good boss against the average. But he's placed in top place. Second place. Place? He's like a Dipsy. Fast melee. But weak. But weak melee at the same time. So it's basically Weak and fast. So yeah, like to see the piranha is sixth place. Which means there's only five bosses left. And let's just say the other five is kind of crazy. Place has yeah, and she does have fast melee, but she really doesn't have quick response. Like she doesn't really have good good ADs. She only has the cannon and the flame. So Spider Pro is coming out of fifth place. Uh, fourth place is the evil evil crawler Toby. He actually well. Creepy, first of all. But basically, he's basically the fourth person, or fourth tubby, to like the fourth best. Like, he's fourth place. That's it. Third place, the bronze medal reward. 
is gonna be the A right Tuppy. Or orange Tuppy. Final best friend trio is now third place. So third place is gonna be the Robo announcers. And not, not the main announcers, but just the members. Both for second place, we have the announcers. And they kind of strong touches, so that's how it appears from. The winner of this and the first bot prize, or the fir first place, is Shadow Tubby. So, money! Money for Shadow Tubby! 